nation's fiercest rivalries. These two teams will battle to see who can bring home the ODK James E. Foy Sportsmanship Trophy. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Auburn lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. the toughness here by this quarterback of sitting in until the last second trying to make a play downfield only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. Now he's scrambling. Decides to slide. He scrambled and picked up a couple of yards. From their own 27 yard line. Third down. Three down, three down. Mike 40, Mike 40, check, check. He's coming, he's coming. He's on the run. And they bring him down to sack on the play. He just blew past the blockers and dragged the quarterback down. Boy, excellent play by the defense here. A few extra seconds, and those receivers might have been open. And that's three and out. Nothing going on that series. Scott is the deep man awaiting the return. And down he goes at the 39-yard line. Not great, but not bad either. As long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position, then you're headed in the right direction. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That's a gain of six on the play. That brings up second and five. Second and five. Ball on their own 45. You can't block me. You can't block me. Thank you. They'll bring him down at the 45-yard line. No gain on the play. Third down. Always a noisy place to play and tough on the offense. Fires quick to an open man. He dropped it. Johnson was the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. Chapman to punt. Heading for the corner. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. He's knocked out of bounds at the 34-yard line. Gain of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Man left, man left. From their own 34-yard line. Three down, three down. It's second down. Cal! Blue 19! Blue 19! Quick throw incomplete. One of his receiver. Number 10, the intended receiver on the way. That'll bring up third and six. Steps out of bounds at the 38. Call it a gain of four yards. That'll make it fourth and two. They've got ten guys up. It looks like they're going to try to block this one. He 
He's tackled at the 30-yard line. Alabama's defense got the stop they wanted on that first drive. Now let's see if they can do it again. And just listen to this crowd, Brad. I mean, you can practically feel the energy coming down from the crowd and how it's impacting these players. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. They get to the quarterback, and now the ball is loose. Brought down at the 23-yard line. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. About the 25 yard line. That makes it third and 15. They can't hear a thing down there. Wants to go long and does. Intercepted. Tackle made right around the 48 yard line. His safety always seems to be in the right place at the right time. It's no surprise that he comes up with the interception here. First and ten. Ball on the 48. Pass complete and taken down immediately. receiver to come down with that ball. Well, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver, and the result, again, a nice play for the offense. From the 30-yard line, first down. They'll work the right side. Nice gain as he works the right side. Call it a gain of five yards. That brings up second and five. complete over the middle. What a play to set him up with a first and goal. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz and a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. It's first down and they'll be looking for six points here. are on the field now. Both teams have their big sets out there. Touchdown, Crimson Tide. The halfback just plowed his way into the end zone. Yeah, but it wasn't all him. The offensive lineman just pancaked the defense on them. And he adds the extra point. It was a six-play, 49-yard drive. And they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. He's to the 20. Tackle made at the 27-yard line. Alabama's defense really came to play early in this football game. Well, they've done a good job here early, but you know eventually this offense is going to start clicking. Let's see if this defense can sustain this for the rest of the game. Now here comes the offense, and you've got to wonder if that last interception's weighing on the quarterback's mind at all. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I wouldn't be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. He's tackled right around the 26-yard line. It's second and ten. From their own 26-yard line. Second down. 
And he's taken down around the 28-yard line. crowd of this stadium always a factor in a football game he airs it out no incomplete Jackson was the intended receiver on the play that'll bring up fourth and nine Chapman is the punter he dropped it and he's taken down at the 30. He just couldn't pull that one in clean. And Brad, that's what happens when you take your eyes off the ball. This was an error that should have been avoided. Their last drive ended with a touchdown. Let's see what happens on this possession. You can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline, though. I don't know if they can stop the passing attack, but they need to at least be able to slow it down. Tackle at about the 29-yard line. Loss of one on the play. That'll bring up second and 11. From their own 29-yard line. Second down. Alabama up seven points. Here they go on the draw, and they'll lose yards. No gain on the play. That makes it third and 11. Throws out to the back, and it's through his hands. Gives the intended receiver on the play. That brings up fourth and 11. Scott is back awaiting the punt. Scott fields it at the 30. He gets out to about the 45-yard line. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Clipping. Receiving team. So they'll move back after Still that costly penalty, and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 27. On the ground, left side. That's good for a gain of four yards. That makes it second and six. Right and left, right and left. Two down, two down. Mike 10. Mike 10, Mike 10. Run, 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 run. And they make the stop at the 33. They're about four yards away here on third down. These fans are showing you why teams hate to come here, folks. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. He's pushed out of bounds around the 48-yard line. A pass like that is so hard to defend because the defender doesn't have a great play on the ball unless it's underthrown. It's all based on connection between the quarterback and his receiver. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 48-yard line. Makes the catch and look out. And he's tackled at the 42. Gain of 10 on the play. That brings up second and one. Fires across the middle. He's at the 30. He's taken down at the 22. That's a gain of 20 on the play. That makes it first and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. And they'll get him in the backfield. Hey, 
Tackled after a decent pickup. Gain of four yards. Third down. Not a lot of offense in quarter number one, but nonetheless, we've got a close game. 7-0, Alabama. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Really one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. Fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. It's up. And they tack on three points. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Alabama is up by four. Complete pass and hit hard as he came down with it. From their own 28-yard line, second down. Throws it in a hurry. He's hit and taken down. First down grab by the receiver. They'll bring him down around the 40-yard line. The defense might need to make some changes to their coverage scheme because that was just too easy. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. Complete. He's got room. Excellent open field tackle. That makes it second and two. Get him for a loss. Loss of two on the run by the halfback. Loss of two yards on the play. That makes it third and three. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Now he's scrambling. Gets past the tackler. Good tackle there in space. Third down has been the charm on this drive. Now it's been all about execution. When it comes to calling the right play at the right time, they've been able to do it here. Alabama is up four. Brought down right around the 32-yard line. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. And this play is number eight on the drive. Nice run to the outside. That brings up second and five. We've got a second and five. Ball on the 27. it off and he's tackled after positive yardage Gibbs picks up five with the carry and this is the tenth play of the drive here's the pitch and now the ball is free and the offense will recover it's fourth down so the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. Kicks away, and he just drilled it from long range.
one's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. I just love to watch this defense play. They've been flying all over the field today, making big play after big play. The crazy thing is, we still have such a close game despite how well they play. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. From their own 35-yard line, it's first down. Ball is loose, fumble, and no one can get it. It bounces out of bounds. Steps out of bounds. Right around the 44-yard line. On the play. That'll bring up second and three. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards right, to pick up the first down. Mike 42, Mike 42. Fires quick. He's got another one. And they push him out around the 35-yard line. First down. He's scrambling. And down he goes around the 34 yard line. That's a That makes it second and eight. It's second and eight. Ball in the 34. Two yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. Third down. Right and left, right and left. Four down, four down. Mike's 42. Mike's 42. Red two. Three. Just throws this one away. They're going to try a long field goal here. Kicks up, and he nails the long field goal. Carlson has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Alabama holds a four-point lead. Fires in a hurry. Interception. To the 20. Lost the ball. Fumble. Recovered by the offense. Close one there. Maybe the ball carrier will try a little harder to secure the ball next time. They're going to review this fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball popped loose. I don't know about this one, Brad. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need indisputable video evidence to overturn this call. After review of the play, the ruling on the field is reversed. So the booth and the referee agree. The runner's knee was down. That was still a close call, though, Brad. Even though he was down, this guy has to do a better job of holding that football. Touchdown, Auburn! So the halfback took it in for six. Simple play call there by the offensive coordinator. Just give it to the back and let him find his way into the end zone. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. 
Auburn gets set to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He takes it right side for a good game. Game seven on the play. That'll bring up second They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. Number 40 on the tackle at the 32-yard line. That makes it third and three. He's got it with room to run. He's out of bounds right around the 34. That'll bring up fourth and one. Scott awaiting the return. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Auburn is up by three. He's looking for his man. And he's taken down at the 30. That's a game of 34 on the play. First down. So let's see how the defense responds now. It's first down and 10. Roger, Roger. My 10. My 10, my 10. He's got it out to his tight end. Tackle right around the 24-yard line. Turner on the tackle at the 24-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Tighten up, tighten up. Pull together. Scrambling around. And he's sacked. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 20. I don't know if they'll be able to hear his cadence in the midst of all this mayhem. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. Dropped him for the second straight time. These hits take a toll on his quarterback, physically and psychologically. The blockers have got to do a better job of taking care of him. Chapman is the punter. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even, and with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He goes out of bounds around the 24-yard line. From their own 24-yard line, it's second down. He's to the 40, and he's shoved out of bounds at the 44-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Out of bounds at the 48. Second and six. 
It's second and six. Ball on their own 48. He zips it. It's knocked away, incomplete. Well defended that time. You're right. Great job here by the defender playing the ball, keeping his balance and getting in the way of that pass. Here's a screen pass. Gets it to the back. He's at the 40. And he's tackled at the 33. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz. And the quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. He gets it up. And it's good. Yeah, he got some good leg behind it. And he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. The score now, Alabama 13, Auburn 13. They're probably just going to squib this kick. I don't think they want to see the return man create lightning before halftime. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. Hands off and not much room there as they try to work the left side. And we'll go into halftime here with a score all deadlocked. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. He's Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Both teams wanted to establish a running game. Both teams were stubborn in trying to do so, and neither team was successful. Did you get the sense the defense knew what was coming? Hey, dude, first and 10 means run. Yeah, I think, I think when you do it every single time, it doesn't really uh, make it hard for a defense to figure out. You can become much more aggressive. You got to take some chances. I, you want to stick with the run. You want to have that balance. But if you don't push the ball down the field, then I never have to honor it. So mix in some first down passes and runs. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. Boy, I hope the second half's as good as the first. Just about set to start the third quarter in a tight one. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 22. Now's when you start to approach each drive, thinking that if you take the lead, then the momentum you gain feels that much more powerful. Pass incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. From their own 22-yard line, second down. Fires quickly to the tight end. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 27-yard line. A five-yard gain. Not a bad play. They gained five yards out of it. They keep moving the defense back. Really one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. And they got him. That's a loss of six yards. Chapman is waiting for the snap. He dropped it. Tackle made at the 45-yard line. A lot of times you'll see teams start to clench up a little bit when games stay close well into the second half. You need to stay loose, keep doing what you've been doing all week in practice, and execute when it's time. Runs left and can't get back to the line of scrimmage. Boy, did you see how the defense just swarmed to the ball carrier? That was fantastic pursuit. Second down, about 12 yards to go. Ball on the 44. Watch 
And he throws it away. Man left, man left. Three down, three down. Yeah, check. Hey, Mike. Hey, no, no. Hey. Here's a quick throw. Completes. It's the junior. Knocked out of bounds at the 34. From the 34 yard line. First down. Three down, three down. Check three, check three, check three. Mike 40, Mike 40, check that. Hey, ruin, ruin. Three on three. Brought down right around the 26 yard line. That makes it second and two. And they make the stop at the 18. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 18. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That makes it second and six. down and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Good outside run there. McClellan picks up about four yards on the play. That brings up second and goal. It's the ninth play of the drive. Everybody bunched up tight defensively. Gibbs sweeps left. Touchdown, Alabama! And he adds the extra point. Alabama ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Right, this has been a great game to watch. A lot of competitive spirit out there. The offenses seem to be going up and down the field. Back and forth we go. I think the winner will be which defense can make that pivotal stop to secure a victory. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Across the middle, tight end's got it. He's tackled at the 43. Gain of 18 yards. First down. From their own 43-yard line. First down. He's taken down at the 47. They pick up good yardage that time on the pass play. Here they kind of put pressure on the quarterback and challenged him to find the hole in the defense. And in this case, he did. Nice job. He has some room. And down he goes at the 37-yard line. That's good for a gain of 10 yards. That makes it first and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 37-yard line. The Tigers wide out, out with an apparent injury, although he might make a comeback before this game's over. Zips it to the back. And they push him out around the 25-yard line. Gain of 12 yards. First down. He's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. They'll bring him down at the 15-yard line. 
First down. From the 15 yard line, it's first down. Caught and he's hit immediately. Number 31 brings him down at the 12 yard line. That'll make it second and seven. Watch down, and he's going to get sacked. Makes the sack. That is a loss of two yards. That'll make it 39. This is the eighth play of this drive. Steps out of bounds at the seven. Fourth down. This isn't much more than an extra point. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Tigers have really surprised everybody in this football game. They have not been intimidated at all, which is great to see. The attitude and effort of this team has put them in a position where they got a shot to win this game here in the second half. This offense just torched the defense through the air with a great passing attack on their last drive. As long as this quarterback has time to throw, then you can guarantee that he'll find the open man. Tackle made around the 34-yard line. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Three down, three down. Alabama is up by four. Straight run here, and he's got nowhere to go. That is a loss of four yards. Third down. sack sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack that's what happened there and that's three and out nothing going on that series certainly they don't have the return on here and this one is a beauty yeah, the defensive coordinator made it a priority to put some pressure on this quarterback. This defense has been bringing the blitz and is having success getting to him. This game has not disappointed the fans of these schools one bit. Either side can make a play that can change the complexion of things. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Pressured and brought down. And they came with just too much pressure for the offensive line to handle. Yeah, that's an excellent play by this defensive end to sneak by the tackle and get to the quarterback for a loss. So that sack sets them back a little bit now. They're looking at second and 13. And he's level at the 40-yard line. Listen to this place. Fires out to his wideout. Man, that's tough for this defense. They came so close to stopping the conversion, but they'll have to stay out there again now. From the 48-yard line, first down. Got an opening. Tackle around the 39-yard line. 
gain of nine yards. That'll make it second and inches. Going for it all to the end zone. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. So it's third down, and they're just inches away from picking up the first down. This crowd can really be intimidating for an opposing team. And he's taken down around the 38-yard line. That's a gain of one on the play. First down. And they got him for a loss. These guys have the capability to gain solid, consistent yardage. They have to regroup and come out a bit more motivated next time. From the 41-yard line, it's second down. He scrambled. And they got him. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. Well, they'll line it up again on third down. Two for two so far on this drive. Here comes the pressure. He wants it all. Touchdown saving tackle, but it leaves him with a first and goal. That's three down and one to go. Alabama's up by four. Great three quarters of action. Tight ball game. And now it's the fourth quarter, and this will decide it. Tackled around the five yard line. That brings up second and goal. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. Loss of four yards on the play. That makes it third and goal. Third and goal, and they can already taste the lead. The intimidation factor is definitely here when you're playing in this stadium. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Loss of six yards on the play. That brings up fourth and goal. They'll call on the field goal unit here. He gets it up, and they tack on three points. They line up to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. Gets to about the 24-yard line. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Alabama up a point. And he hits him hard at the 23-yard line. Second and 11. We've got a second and 11. Ball on their own 23. Fires it out. Brought down at the 35 yard line.
gets to about the 37-yard line. Call it a gain of two yards. That'll make it second and seven. From their own 37-yard line. Second down. And watch out, they're going to bring the heat right here. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. It's been a good day for this defensive lineman, really showing off his skills. Yeah, he really has, Brad. I'm just amazed with his ability to swarm to the football on almost every single play. And I'll tell you, Brad, I think he's just so big and athletic. He's just a nightmare for this offensive line. They just cannot do a very good job sustaining blocks against him. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Scrambling around. And he's tackled in the open field. That's good for a game of four yards. That makes it second and six. From their own 24-yard line. Second down. Now he's scrambling. He's tackled at the 34-yard line. Gain of 10 yards. That makes it first and 10. Nice run to the outside. They get about four on that keeper. That brings up second and five. From their own 38-yard line. It's second down. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Oh, the loss of four yards on the play. That brings up third and ten. Always a noisy place to play and tough on the offense. Let's it fly. The hit knocks it loose. Incomplete. Chapman to punt. Taken down at the 35. He showed a good burst there. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Alabama is up one. He's under pressure. Hit as he threw, and he completes it. He's taken down around the 47-yard line. It's first and ten. Ball in their own 47. He fights forward to around midfield. That's a game of three on the play. That makes it second and six. Side run there. Seven yards there on that bit of misdirection. It's third down, and they're about the length of the football away from the first down marker. And his hands on it and drops. 
dropped it. Burton is the intended receiver on the play. That makes it fourth and inches. Scott, back to return it. It's away, and it's a booming punt. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Look at the scramble down. He can't get away from the pressure. Loss of 10 yards on the play. That'll make it second and long. So the sack makes this a second and long. Now he tries to buy some time. There's a very impressive open field tackle. Gain of five yards. That makes it third and 15. All day, dog. Mike 42, Mike 42. Just under three to go in regulation. With the pass incomplete. There's a flag down on the field, and I'm betting that this one is pass interference. Defense. Complete breakdown in judgment and discipline. These are the types of mental errors that drive coaches crazy. First down, 10 yards to go. All on the 30-yard line. Come on, team! Black five, black up. He's going to try and scramble. They bring him down. I think this defensive end is doing a great job of getting after the quarterback, not only with the sack in this case, but it seems like the entire game, he's done a good job of creating pressure, making this quarterback feel him, and almost giving him happy feet back there. He doesn't seem to be in rhythm and almost seems to be throwing the football, feeling the, the pressure and almost creating nerves on the quarterback. So it's second down and 13 yards to go following that quarterback sack. Fires out quickly to the tailback. And down he goes at the 28. No gain on the play. That'll make it third and 13. You expect this every time you're here, and you're never disappointed. This crowd is amazing. That's a great tackle at the 20-yard line. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive lineman and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. After the sack, it's now fourth and long. Going deep. Well, that one should do it. A fourth down stop here late in the fourth quarter, and that should be the nail in the coffin in this game. And they're going to have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long. How much you can do there. you got to go for it and give yourselves a chance. Here we are late in the fourth quarter. This is what this game has come down to. Every possession is going to count, and this could be the one right here. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. On the ground with the tailback. Nice run to the left there. Auburn just took their first time out. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Nice run there. The Tigers are going to call their second time out. Back with a carry. Touchdown tie. Wow, did they need that one? And he converts the extra point. 
Looks like they're ready for the kick. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. He's under some heat. They'll bring him down around the 30-yard line. That's a game of five on the play. That brings up second and five. And he stops the clock with a spike. Someone wanted a little head start there. Offside. Defense. They got across the line a bit Still too soon. Down. Give the quarterback some credit here for using his cadence to draw the defense offsides. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. A little over a minute in the game. He's scrambling. Tackle made at the 43-yard line. They'll get the first check, down. Check. He made the correct decision to tuck it and go. First down. The lineman got a little ahead of the snap count. Here's the call. Ball start. Offense. You got to be careful to avoid these. Penalties are a great way Still to stall down. out a drive. So we'll have first and 15 after the penalty. He's flushed and they got it. That's a loss kill, kill, yards. kill. Yellow three. Yellow three. Go ahead, two. Spikes the ball. Orange three. Orange three. Third down and a mile. And this is going to be hard to convert here. They can't hear a thing down there. And he is drilled at the 41. Wow, a long yeah, game, yeah, but yeah. still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt themselves by digging themselves into a hole on first and second down. So the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. Well, player down, and his teammates obviously worried after that play. The whistle hasn't sounded yet. They still have to snap the ball and make sure they don't make any mistakes. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. Favorite play in football of your quarterback. Take a knee. The Tigers using their third and last timeout. Alabama up by eight. Takes a knee. Crimson Tide. As we wrap this game up, Kirk, what final thoughts do you want to share? They've talked about the rivalry all week long, and for good reason. We saw the intensity down on the field every play, and it showed us why these teams love to hate each other. It'll be interesting to see how this game carries over the next time they play. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.